Hey guys, it is currently 2 o'clock Saturday, December 31st, New Year's Eve. I know, 2 o'clock. I have been a lazy bum all day today. I did film a PR video though, so got that checked off my list. Um, Basically, I'm going to sit you guys down and explain kind of what I'm doing today. But before I do that, we are going to go take some pre-workouts. I need that to kick in so I can work out. I'm getting my pre-workout ready. But today, we are going to rearrange and deep clean my room. So, I really want to deep clean and rearrange my room because... Yeah, I'm getting old of it and I need to deep clean it. I haven't deep cleaned it, <clears throat> like deep cleaned it in a while. Also, this is the Alani Cosmic Stardust pre workout. Love it, it tastes so good. You know, when you get old of your room and you want to rearrange things, so it's really hard to do that in my room because there's not much things you can move around. But, came up with an idea. I don't really know if it will work because I'm waiting for something to come in the mail and it won't come till like late January, but I'm not waiting that long. Do you guys chug your pre-workout or sip it? I don't know how people chug it. I'm a sipper. I don't know how people chug this. Same with greens. Does anyone else not like greens? I've tried blue. Was it blue? I don't think it was blue. Maybe it was blue. I tried Oh, greens from Marshall, then I tried a popular brand of greens. Hated it. I got a flavored one too. It was nasty. I wish I was one of those girls who like it. I don't know how people like it. I think it's so gross. And it's so expensive. I would love to try a lot of new greens <clears throat> or Kiala's, but it's so expensive. <laughs> Am I the only one who does this? Whenever I drink something, I cannot finish the bottom of it. I don't know if anyone's like that. But it like grosses me out. So I'm going to wait 20 minutes. Let the pre-work out. Kick in. Uh. <gasps> oh my god. Is that my Walmart package? <gasps> it wasn't supposed to come today. This was not supposed to come today. I mean, I'm assuming it's mine. <gasps> it is. I don't think this is mine. Because I didn't order two heavy things. Okay. Let's open our Walmart packages. First time ever. I'm not doing a haul on TikTok. I always film hauls on TikTok, but I filmed so much today, I feel like, and YouTube needs a haul. My mixer, again, this stuff was not supposed to come today, so I'm so excited. This is my mixer. Basically, oh, I know why it's so heavy. Oh, maybe this is my Celsius. Maybe this isn't my mixer. I actually think this is my Celsius. Now that makes sense. I forgot I ordered Celsius. <gasps> yes! Okay. I lied. This is not my mixer. I don't think my mixer came yet. That's why I was very confused. So. I don't like the carbonated Celsius. Or special. So you know. I ordered a 12 pack. Of the green tea ones. This is the peach mango green tea. Non-carbonated because I don't like that. So. A 35. This is one, two, three, four, five, six packs of 35 things of gum. Now we got this big boy. I don't know what's in here because I don't, I don't really know. Oh my god. It's my mixer. I got a mixer for Christmas and it was the wrong wattage. So I ordered another one. This was a really cheap one. So let's hope she does not break. It was either a really expensive one or a really cheap one. Are you freaking kidding me? What the hell? This is not a freaking mixer. This is not a mixer. Oh my god. What the hell? That's not a freaking mixer. 
I ordered a mixer. So basically, I'm gonna have to return these freaking skates. But at least I got my huge gum and my huge thing of Celsius. And then we got a thing of skates. Okay. So I never do those cool downs, but. <clears throat> I did it. Oh god, I just got this on it. I never do those cool downs, but I decided to do one and I want to give a little shout out to Grow with Joe. So I've been in Grow with Joe for literally years. Like I feel like during quarantine maybe I found her. Everyone talks about Chloe Teen, blah blah blah. No one talks about Grow with Joe. Like I don't think anyone I know, everyone I know talks about Chloe Ting. And I'm like, Chloe Ting has never worked for me. Personally, I don't like her workouts, but girl with Joe, let me talk about her. So I just did, hold on, let me show the camera. I just did the four mile sweaty and intense belly fat walking workout. It's also like an ab melt and it's about an hour long. So that's the workout I just did. Um, basically, that's my first time doing that workout. I love it, it's my new favorite. But yeah, I've been doing girl with Joe for literally forever. And she has so many different workouts. She has, um, so she has different times. So like some could be 10 minutes to an hour and a half. Like she has different lengths. She has different types of workouts. You can do ab, glute, leg, butt, arm, chest. Um, some with weights, some without weights. Some are floor workouts. I like the standing workouts because personally, I don't like to get it up all on the floor. She has beginners intense intermediate she has dance party workouts so with doja like not with doja cat like using doja cat music lizzo like gospel like she has a bunch of different workouts which i love because it suits literally everyone i actually see progress i feel good she's so hype um she's so just positive and i i love it i love her and she's just such a positive person and i literally love doing her workouts and i've been doing it for forever so i can actually tell you that i've seen progress and that i love her workouts and i just love how there's a bunch of different ones that fits everyone but love her go check out girl joe i'll probably link her in the description down below so you can check out her channel it is 3 48 and i'm done with my workout i'm gonna take a little breather um before I start cleaning my room and getting started with all that because I know it's gonna take a while and be really stressful and crazy. So I just wanna take time and breathe. So glad I took pre-workout because I would have died and now I still have energy I feel like, which is great. I literally love a lot of new pre-workout. But anyways, I'm going to take a breather, go on my phone for a second and then start cleaning um basically to let you guys know kind of what i'm doing or what my plan is so kink tapestry is right there is a bed and then right here is a bed so basically i want to change it up and i want to move this bed over where that bed is because it's a twin bed and i want to move that twin bed here because i feel like it will make this space look more open because i'll have this open area and then I'll have an open area here. I don't know. I'm just going to move stuff around. See how I like it. See how everything looks. Might not like it. I might change it back. We'll see. I was literally so close to falling asleep. Like I was on the verge of falling asleep. And I was going to take a nap. And I was going to say, Caitlin, you can do your room tomorrow. I've been throwing off cleaning my room for like ever. I was like, Caitlin, just take a, just take a nap. You can do it tomorrow. But no. I got up. Kicked the dogs out, got my Celsius. This is the peach mango green tea, non-carbonated. I do not like the sparkling one, um, and I love green tea, so these are great. And I really need to get going, but I'm just feeling so out of it and so tired. My current favorite show that I'm watching is Shameless. It's literally so good. I think I'm on like season six or seven. So while I clean up my room and do everything, I'm gonna watch Shameless. If you haven't watched Shameless, you're crazy. It's so good. So it's 
like 7 20 i didn't do any more time lapses because i just got stressed and like yeah and then i felt really nauseous but i'm feeling better now i sat down and took a break but i'm gonna show you guys what's going on and what i have left to do so here's the twin bed i switched the blankets around because this was my christmas blanket with the christmas trees but it's reversible so i flipped it to the red and white extra pillows and squishmallows just laying here and then you come over here i have to post that and sell that stuff here's the bed i'm thinking about moving this over there when i sell that stuff but for now i'm gonna see i don't think it will fit over here but we're gonna try and then i still have that stuff to like move around i'm gonna be posting everything on like makari and um poshmark offer up all that stuff like all the stuff i'm getting rid of i gotta clear off this table and see if i can move it over here gonna move the table see if it will fit i don't think it will but you know so anyways i'm gonna finish this stuff up clear this table off so i can move the table because the table is so freaking heavy and like impossible to move so <clears throat> Didn't record because I really got ugh, really got in the zone. Really got in like the feel. I got in the like zone of cleaning my room. So recording. So recording was extra time. Here it is. So I have I'm not gonna show that because I have stuff there. But oh, what I love is when you come in, you can't see any of the stuff behind there. And then you have my closet area which i'm gonna reorganize oh. and you have my little nightstand which i'm gonna get an extender cord and i'm pretty sure I put the nightstand over, over there and then you have my little vanity area i don't like how this is over there but i just oh, forgot my hiccups are annoying me just put it there this is stuff i'm listing my poshmark and stuff which you can check out tv workout stuff squish mellow shoes Dresser, books, candy lamp, reading corner, desk, trash. This is like my living room. This is my Cricut stuff, which I like how you can't really. It doesn't look as cluttered as it did over here. So like you just come in and it looks so open. It looks 20 times better than it did before. Adding stuff to my Poshmark and Macari. Link in description. Probably all I'm going to record tonight. Happy New Year. Sorry this was a bust. Bye. Hey guys, it is 11 o'clock, January 1st. I took a shower and now I'm about to do some 2023 journal. Sorry. I'm about to do some 2023 journaling stuff. I wasn't going to record today. But then I was like, I didn't really record much yesterday. And that video turned out to be a flop. So I was like, I'll do a two-day video. Um, And I might go to Target today. So I was like, why not? I really want to get in like a good spirit um, for 2023 and I got this from a friend for Christmas. It says choose your path. So I was like, I don't know. I want to write some out, make some manifestations. Um, I don't know. I saved some stuff to my favorites of things I want to do. And I'll let you know what I find and what I'm going to do and write out and yeah. But basically, I just want to have like a better mindset going into 2023, especially since last year, the start of the new year was an awful year and a lot of bad stuff happened and it was just not the best. So I really want to go into 2023 with a better mindset and more positivity. So I'm going to write down goals and like things I'm letting go of. I'm trying to think of like a really fun, bright color I'm going to use. So now. I'm going to flip to the next page and I'm just going to write out my manifestation. I'm going to write out what I want to manifest, my dream life, what I want to happen. I'm also going to write, I saw this thing that was like, write a hundred things. Write down what you want, what you need, all that, and check it off as those things happen. And I really feel like that changes the perspective of life and kind of like what happens in life. So I really want to do that. So I'm going to write down my dreams, my needs, my wants, all that, and I'll come back. So now 
I'm going to make a vision board to set as my iPad wallpaper. So we're going to do that. And we're just going to make a my wallpaper and make a vision board and all the pics and stuff that I want and all that fun stuff. So I'm going to grab my iPad and we're going to do that right now. So I'm going to go on Pinterest and we are going to find... So, I already have a Pinterest board that's manifest because, duh, I made my new lock screen <clears throat> a little bit ago, so, yeah. Here's my manifest board. So, you guys can look at my Pinterest to find this. Here's my Pinterest. You guys can follow it. So, I have a say section which are things you can say to manifest in your life a do <clears throat> these are more like morning routines and like how to be that girl and just things you can do and then these are actual like not these are just manifest pictures i literally have a ton of keeps going and that is my manifesting so there's things you can say things you can do and just things you can save and have as a manifest for 2023, my main thing is working on my relationship with God and all that. Definitely have been struggling and it's something I don't really talk about. I'm not really open about it. I don't really talk about it much. But 2022 has been my worst year as far as my faith and all that. Um, I've never felt so far and distant and confused so 2023 i definitely want to work on that and a better mindset my vision board i'm gonna use procreate and pinterest and then set it as my lock screen so i will let you guys know when i'm done it's four o'clock and we're heading to target i do have to get one thing which is a um outlet extender so we're gonna get that at target i am very very tired today like i just wanted to take a nap but i didn't because i knew we'd be going to target i just didn't know when so i didn't fall asleep but we're gonna head out now pulling in to target hopefully the lines aren't crazy long today because i do need to get the outlet extender so we just left target and i did not record because it was Hectic, but I'll give you guys a little the haul. I don't love rollers, but I love dark chocolate and I love caramel. I need dark chocolate rollers. I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try the dark chocolate roller. Let's see. I don't really like rollers either, but I like dark chocolate, so I was like, I wouldn't buy again, but like good, I guess. Yeah. And now they're at Target has these like gluten free cookies that were Christmas. At first, they didn't really have a taste, but they're actually really good. Okay. Mm. I don't know if they're really good, they're good. Yeah, we gotta get crickets for Kenya. So I'm going to give you guys a little haul and then I think I'm going to go to sleep. But, because I'm really tired. Starting off, I spent like $15 on this when I literally was expecting to spend like 8 But I needed this for my Cricut area over there because now I don't have one over here. So yeah, I was literally, and I was trying to match, like price match it because online it said like, but it was like a different brand. And I'm like, it's the same thing. I love Hershey Kisses. And I have a candy jar, as you guys know, so about that. And then, like you guys saw, the rollers. I got a wrapping paper, that was like 90 cents. So that's what I got because they had a good sale. And I'm gonna nap now. And don't know if I'll vlog again, because I don't know when I'm gonna wake up. Oh, there is one thing I wanna show you guys that I love. So basically, here's my candy section. So I have, for like, my friends come over. I have a thing of gum and a bunch of candy and I have more candy in here. So people can just take whatever candy they want. I don't know, just thought I would show that because it is so fun and yeah.
Oh my god, guys, I realized I never filmed this. I literally was laying down, like, getting comfortable, and I realized I never filmed this. Thank you guys so much for 150 subscribers. I'm so happy. A lot of people, especially from my school, who watched this are probably, like, 150 subscribers. Let's be for real, girl. But I'm so freaking grateful, and 150 subscribers was such a big milestone for me. And I'm so grateful and like, I don't know, I'm so happy. I plan on doing a waking up at 5 a.m. for a week or a followers control my day video. And I want to bake something and like, you know, write 150 on it. I'm just waiting to get my mixer in the mail and waiting for a day to do that with Abby because I feel like that'd be a lot of fun. So thank you guys for 150 subscribers. I'm going to be doing a video dedicated to that i literally got up just to film that okay now i'm for real going to bed january 8th and i filmed that video january 1st so it's been a week but i'm editing the video i'm here at the abbey we got two more videos coming out yeah two more videos so mm -hmm. stay tuned for those finally getting this video out i'm very happy i've been procrastinating on it but of course i forgot to do an outro like i always do so make sure you like the video make sure you subscribe comment down below what should our question of the day be okay the question of the day is what's your favorite candy so comment down below what's your favorite candy and let us know